First at 530, though, we are getting more insight into a case of an alleged police impersonator in Kokomo. Tonight, we are hearing from the alleged victims and the man accused of pulling them over. Jackie Collins and Sammy Irwin were driving on US 931 in Howard County on July 12th when they say a black Dodge Dart pulled behind them and activated his yellow lights. Jackie says the car pulled them over a second time after they pulled away. She says the suspect, Trevor Bontrager, cussed at them. Bontrager is charged with impersonating a public servant. He works for a roadside assistance organization called Guardian Angel Assistance and says the couple gestured at him, so he thought they needed help. I go past them. They yell something at me. I cannot make it out because I'm jamming, so I turn my music down and I, I, I kind of slow down and I look back and I'm trying to figure out if they need help, why they were going slow, whatever. At the very first I thought, you know, maybe he needs something. Maybe, maybe there's something hanging from our car. There's a reason why he's pulling us over. And then, you know, to be approached by someone who says, what's your problem with explicit language that immediately turns what could have just been a misunderstanding into a potentially violent situation. We also talked with Alan Edwards, the director and founder of Guardian Angel Assistance, who says his employee is innocent until proven guilty. He says Bontrager is on administrative leave and is not going out on calls until the situation can get sorted out. Police officers located handcuffs, a shotgun and a pellet gun inside the vehicle. But Edwards says the handcuffs are for novelty purposes.